location, I think it's going to be a little different. Yeah. Okay, it looks like we're getting right into it. Unless this is hand warmers, I'm not sure. But it looks like it's not. Um, so Twinkie's playing Falcon. Um, we might have, were we watching him earlier? On PM? Yeah. We were? I think so. Yeah, I think we were watching his Falcon. Um, and I think he won the game we were watching. So now he's playing Melee, and he's going up against Dwight. Dwight's a very good PM player. Um, he knows Zelda and PM very well. I don't know how if he knows her quite as well in Melee. I'm, I mean, I definitely know he doesn't know her quite as well in Melee. And also, she's just not as good in Melee. By a lot. Yeah. She has a lot of problems. But she's, she's playing pretty well. He's playing pretty well with her. Yeah, he seems to know what he's doing with those side Bs. Um, I never use those. I don't know if they're good. But it seems like they, he can use them. This is kind of an interesting match because they both have like the really powerful forwarder and back where Yeah. It has like she has something that's very similar to the knee, the flash kick. Yeah, yeah. There it is. Really, really good. I mean it's hard to hit, but it's like so much knockback. So yeah, I think I like I kinda see this match as like like Zelda's like a nine to five character, right? Like it's like you gotta work every moment yeah. of the day to like get your match won. So, yeah. and like, where Cam Falcon can kind of like get a few good tech chases and just erase a stock. Definitely. So, if the Zelda player is able to like sort of just sort of stay on top of it and not get lazy, then yeah, like, I totally yeah. expect to see uh, Zelda win the match. But it's, it's tricky, you know. Like, yeah, it's, it's definitely a tough match. I think, like, if Falcon knows what he's doing and he can combo, it's going to be really hard. Yeah. If, he, if he's not punishing super hard, then I think, like, you know, go either way. Yeah. You know who is uh, one of the better Zelda players in Melee? Not that you could, like, one of the few people who you could say is a Zelda player. Uh, Cosmo Wright, I think it's yeah. uh, from the Midwest, speedrunner. Mm -hmm. uh, he was in the Melee scene for like four or five years, like in the old MLG days right. and stuff. He yeah. was a Zelda man. He's yeah. still pretty good. Yeah, he is pretty good. He enters tournaments and stuff. So. Yeah. So, so it's, yeah, it's interesting, you know, like. Yeah. It's kind of cool thing about Melee is, like, you see the low tiers, like, they can do stuff. Yeah, know? they can still do stuff. A lot of people give them, like, zero credit, but they can definitely, like, yeah. if you you play against, like, a good young link player and you don't know what you're doing, you're going to get bodied. Yeah, yeah, like, absolutely. This Zelda knows about combo fastballers, clearly. Yeah, you know? <laughs> definitely. It's nice spacing, too, just generally. It's kind of a uh, optimistic uh, grab attempt, but still uh, recovering well. Keldiar says, Cosmo dropped Zelda, he plays Falco Fox now. I mean, that's true, but he can still play. I mean, he doesn't play as much anymore. So. Kick him in the Falcon. Oh, my God. It's kind of fun to like watch the low tiers, because I feel like that's when I like, really like learn like the fun facts of the game. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, the characters you don't see very often, it's like, oh, Zelda can do that? Like, yeah, It's kind of right. cool, you know? Like, yeah, because, I mean, how many Zelda players do you see ever? Uh, 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 recovery is it's harder, I think, in this than it is in uh, yeah. PM. I'm not really sure, because I don't know her in really either game, to be honest, so. Yeah. But you can see Dwight, like, doing, like, there's a lot of his moves he's throwing out that aren't connecting, but I think he's expecting them to connect just because of playing PM Zelda. Right. Yeah. You know, like, like, up tilts have, like, way bigger hitbox than PM. Yeah, than yeah. Like, yeah, I think her up tilt's pretty pretty bad. But yeah, he's still getting those four airs pretty solidly. So good stuff. That's why he takes the first one. That was the last dock though, so. Twinkie's still like playing well. PM recovery is super easy in comparison. Lots more horizontal drift. Yeah, that's kinda what I figured. Um more horizontal drift and like I think there's like more vertical drift like when it's going. Like when you start the upbeat. Um, yeah, the European tip box is better in PM, but I think it I'm, I think it still exists in May. Yeah. It's, it's the same, it's the same cool. There is no real appearance hit in box and melee. I th I'm pretty sure there is. I could be wrong. On that. I'm pretty sure. Maybe, maybe you're right. Actually, maybe it's only. It, there's either a hitbox on the start or the end of it. Yeah. I don't remember which. 
I know, because uh, I remember some, like, way back in the day testing uppies, and, like, Mewtwo's was the only one without any hitbox on it. Okay, there's a hitbox on the start. Okay. Okay, so we actually have a Chem Fox player switching a Fox here. Twinkie playing some Fox. Okay. I think, he, I think he plays Fox. Fox. And then you play Melee Fox, it's like... It's like playing Star like StarCraft One after you played StarCraft Two or something. You're like that's like true. An NES game, yeah. you know, like it's so. But I think this. I mean, the skill definitely like transfers. Oh yeah. You just, like, like unlike I think. Well, I mean, a lot of a lot of characters transfer, but I feel like Zelda will give you bad habits, but Fox same stuff will work. Uh, yeah. You know, Zelda like if you do up tilt and stuff. Yeah. So not punished for not sweet spotting, but you know. It's harder with Fox than Falcon. Okay. He gets, there you go. Just the raw smash. Back air. I feel like Oh wow, good sweet spot. I would not That's that's so much harder in this game too. He's always kind of floating too, so like he's out of a uh, up for up air range. Great uh, assault. Stock despite Fox having that lead there for a minute. Yeah. Yeah, but you know Fox takes it right back. He's gonna get those. I mean, he's gonna get up. He's gonna get back airs. He's gonna get up airs. That's just all free. Fox seems to have trouble L canceling. Yeah. Like right, this like being a Fox player, like. Mm -hmm. What? In all fairness, that's gonna affect him less as Fox than it would as Falcon. Yeah. So. Unless he's trying to do a lot of shield pressure stuff, but... Yeah. It doesn't really look like that's like his game. What's yeah. What's his account? Uh, it's... It's 1-0 Dwight right now. Do you want to play stream or do you want to just play? It's up to you. I'll play stream. Try stream. Yeah, we can play a minute. Yeah, let's do stream. So... Wow, oh, that's nice. nice. Nared it, down smash. So, like, I mean, like, it's, it's, it's clear that, like, some of the PM stuff's carrying over, right? Like, it's funny, though. Like, isn't it, like, probably always, like, a pretty satisfying moment when you're, like, you're playing, uh, you're playing melee. I mean, it's satisfying, but, like, confusing. You're playing melee, they pick Zelda, and you're, like, okay, a chic player. And, like, you start thinking, and you do some bands, or yeah. whatever, and then they're, like, they just stay Zelda. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Yeah, they can really throw you off. Because yeah. you have a game plan. Yeah, it's just funny, like, how that is in this game. It's the same character. Boom. Yeah, I wonder I wonder if anyone does that in PM. Yeah. Like, pick Zelda and then hold A or something. Yeah, yeah. I think I would do that. Like, That'd be funny, you, dude. Yeah, yeah. You really throw people off. No rules against it. Like, it's the same character, or, technically. I wonder if you can pick Sheik and hold A and get Zelda. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's really funny. Yo, totally Zelda true. mains, can you do that? Yeah, can you pick Sheik and hold A and, and then PM? transform to and transform to Zelda before the game starts just to throw off your opponent? Because then they're like they're like picking stages and like okay I'm playing yeah this. I'm they think they're playing Sheik. against it's yeah like, I don't want to go to Yoshi's I don't want to get Gimp so like they're like thinking about all these things right like like totally not relevant in the matchup like yeah <laughs> yeah because that could really throw off your throw off like everything that you that yeah. I don't think so people try sometimes and they just start a Zelda. Okay. What I always wondered, and this is like me, like young me, like when I was like, I went to MLG for Halo, right? Yeah. And in Smash, I always noticed that like there are all these people who like played Sheik, and like no one really played Zelda. But I was like, isn't it just better to like main both characters? Because then you like have you can pick two characters and they can pick one. It's like totally unfair. Yeah. You know? but, <laughs> yeah. But a pro they have such a different play styles. I know. It was always funny. Like they, I always thought it was like it like worked that way. Like as a kid, you know. Yeah. I was like, oh, Sheik's so unfair. It's like two characters. And Dwight takes it. Good stuff from him. You yeah, remember the commentating match at the end, though? He's doing pretty well. Fox is a tough matchup for Zelda. Fox is a tough matchup for almost every low tier. Yeah. 